Hello all. Welcome once again to your channel. Adaptive immunity, also known as specific or acquired immunity, is capable of recognizing and selectively eliminating specific foreign antigens. It does not come into play until there is an antigenic challenge to the host organism. Four characteristic features are hallmarks of adaptive immunity. First, antigenic specificity that is immune cells or their products display strict specificity towards the antigens. Second, diversity that is different immune cells or their products for each and every antigen or epitope exists. Third, the ability of distinguishing self from non-self or foreign so that immune response is mounted only towards the foreign. And fourth, immunological memory or anamnesis which is defined as the ability to remember the first contact with an antigen and respond more powerfully to the same in all subsequent encounters with the same antigen. All of these features are displayed by B and T lymphocytes. Hence, these are the main players of adaptive immunity, making the possessor of them immunocompetent. Although adaptive immunity takes some time to develop, still it is indeed much more mighty and effective that specifically encounters the invading antigens much faster and better. This is definitely attributed to aforementioned properties of adaptive immunity that is specificity, diversity, recognition of self versus non-self and memory. Most importantly, the mutual cooperation and teamwork of B cells and T cells enhances the power of adaptive immunity even further. B lymphocytes produce antibodies after the appropriate clonal selection required to clear a particular antigen from the host body, so it's called humoral immunity. On the other hand, T lymphocytes themselves participate physically in receiving the processed antigen presented on MHCs, hence are set to impart CMI or cell-mediated immunity. That's all for now. See you very soon. Take care.